Looking for cheap Madden 20 coins? Head on over to CoinStoreHub.com for the cheapest Mutt coins online. Make sure you use code Dollars for 10% off your order. Get your guy squad and dominate. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the best Madden 20 tip channel on YouTube.com. We are here baby and now we are in the Cincinnati Bengals offensive scheme. I told y'all I'm going to keep rocking out these money plays as long as y'all keep showing me the love. So go ahead, drop a like on the video, make sure your notifications are turned on. And I want to give a shout out to Keys Incorporation and Keelan Wilbur. Now, they are entered into a $25 Xbox or PSN giveaway at the end of the month. Every time somebody likes, shares, or comment on the video, early, as soon as the video is released, they get entered into the giveaway monthly. So make sure that you got your notifications turned on. Enough blabbing, let's get into the money scheme. So this tight doubles is what I like to use. So my audibles is Z-Spot, Halfback Draw, Flood and curl. Now you can audible to the gun doubles, audible one time to the right, and now you have the 01 trap inside zone, the sale play, and the PA read. There's the sale, and then we also got the 01 trap. A good play to mix in. If y'all want a scheme like that, make sure y'all let me know. The play we're going over right now is the PA wide receiver cross. I like to turn it into a trips type look. We're going to play against a random play. I don't know what kind of defense they running. I see one high safety. It could be man coverage. It could be cover three, but we're going to motion over. Make sure you're in the middle of the field or on the right hash mark. Now, this is what the play looks like. I like to do a few things on this. First thing I like to do is get that X open. Everybody knows about that route, so I will streak my tight end. Then I will ID right here, block that running back. Now, what are you going to do with that Y? You can do a couple things. Put him in the hitch and playmaker him open or put him in a zig and he will kill man coverage. You ready? Let's go. What kind of defense is he running? There's the zig. Boom. Take your yards right away. And that's a big boy. We're going to run somebody over and we're going to have fun today because y'all killing that like button. So we're going to do it again. He's bringing a lot of people in. Looks like heavy blitz. We're going to ID. We're going to block running back. We can put A in a streak. We can put X in a zig that time, and then we can put Y in a slant. You can mix it up. You can do whatever you want to do, baby. I'm just going to give you the main things. I'm expecting heavy pressure, so I want that zig to get open real fast. Boom. Now we hike the ball. He hit him. There's Y over the top, and we can possession catch that. Uh, hit him in his mouth, didn't we? Let's look at that replay. He took my first read away. That's okay. I know if his user is in the middle of the field, look at that, that was good defense. He made my zig route not even worth anything. Now I know that second route, that slant or that other button is going to always get open. Nice touch pass to the sidelines. Now they have to worry about your tight end too. We're going to see if we can get the tight end on this play. We should be able to get the tight end on this play. So my boy X Factor is lighting up right now. His X Factor is lighting up. So another thing you can do is put him on the drag. That's a high, low read. So we're going to come, hike the ball. I can see A, but I can see my Y. Now I got a blocker down the field. Now I got a blocker down the field. We picked up about 25, 30 yards with a short dump off. Let's see what we can do this time. What is the defense going to bring? This time, we're going to put Y on a fake, on a uh, streak down the field. We're going to put X in just a little fade. And then we're going to put our A in a quick out route. If it's man coverage, we're going to be able to hit A. If they drop back and play sticks like a lot of scared people do, we're going to be able to hit X. We might be able to get AJ Green for a one play touchdown. Let's see. He goes down, he gets bumped, we're going to hit X. We're going to hit X. Now he should have turned around and caught that. And Y would have got open eventually. But y'all see what I'm able to do, man. Just read the defense. We're going to put A in a quick out route. We're going to streak Y. We're going to put X and a flat. It's looking like that. What is we going to have open? Hit him again. 
I can see why right over the middle for possession catch and he holds on to it because his X Factor is lit up. Now, another thing you can run into is this Z spot. Still do that same motion if you're in the middle of the field or the right. So what I want to do right here is put X and a fade. I want them to go deep. Put X and a quick out route. And now we got a flood on that right side. So if they back off pressure, we can hit Y for a high point pass or a low ball pass. If they don't guard the running back right away, you can hit the running back. If they do like a hard flat on the running back, you can hit A. You got a lot of different things you can do on this play. Now that X, he's going to take away anybody that has to drop down in like a, a cloud flat or a hard flat. And you're going to be able to throw X open to the outside. So let's see what kind of pressure they play. So there's X to the outside. We're going to throw that. Boom. Now I didn't even look to the right side of the field. You got a lot of different things you can do on that right side of the field. Also, like He's going to take away any kind of deep blues. He's going to be underneath. They have to respect that. Now you can even streak AJ Green like that because if you want to just hit him down the seams, you can do that. You can mix it up however you want to. I'm just giving you the money play setups. So here we go. Straight down the seams. I see him over the top. He wide open. They concentrating on underneath routes and now I just took the top off on you because they smashing that light button. We're going to go to that Z spot again. We're going to bring him over. He got a linebacker out there. So we can streak him, put him underneath, fade him. Now this time we're going to look to the right side of the field. Running back or tight end. So what kind of throw is we going to do? So there he is. He beat him. Try to do man coverage. That's a man coverage beater. Or you can do an out route. It's all up to y'all. I'm just giving y'all the secret ingredients. Y'all cook up the recipe how y'all want to. Now, right now it looks like he's in all out blitz. This is what we like. It looks like he in all out blitz. Guess what I'm going to do? ID right here. Block that running back. And I went into the flood play. All out blitz. I went into the flood. All I'm going to do is put that tight end in a quick out. And I'm going to send that uh, B down the field. So, on that left side, it's going to get compressed. So you're going to look for that quick out right here. They ain't going to keep running man coverage when you bust them in the mouth. So we're going to hike the ball. We can low ball that. If he plays over the top, we can low ball that fall down. You don't have to get a big hit. Don't try to let the computer make some crazy stuff happen and they give you the ball back. Like I said, you can go into this flood. You can do a quick out route, streak, block running back, and he going to get underneath most of the time. Low ball. Boom. Easy dot, man. Easy, easy dot. Now, once you're hitting them with underneath ropes like this, guess what? They're going to want to play hard flat. So if they jump on him aggressive, your X would be on the back side. Trust me. So if they jump over him aggressive, they didn't do it that time. So he got open. If they come down and they do aggressive over the top of that X, your back side, watch this. So Floyd, we're going to hit him underneath a couple times. We're going to force him to play that with A. So there he is. Oh, he wide open. He burnt. He burnt it. <laughs> Juke him there. Juke him. Run him over. He a little baby. Run him over. Run that little baby over. Put a pacifier in his mouth. That's what we all about. So we're going to go into flood. We're going to do out route, streak, block running back. Come on. Play aggressive. There you go. Now watch the X. X is right over the backside. Tippy toes for the touchdown. If they playing hard flats, that's a no-no. If they playing hard flats, look. He over the top of me aggressive right here watch uh look at my ex my ex gets open my corner gets open i know this baby and you're gonna be able to do the same thing man you can do some crazy stuff with this we're gonna go into flood we're gonna do boom 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 it's gonna look like that let's see if we can hit the y is he gonna play him aggressive can we hit that y there's the y the other side of the field, I mean, you able to hit him on the right side of the field. You able to hit him on the left side of the field. We don't know what defense he's running, but we know where the dot's at. So is the A open? Oh, he wide open. He wide open. We're going to take that all game, ain't we? We real players over here, bro. We real players. If they give it to us, we're going to take it. If they give it to us, we're going to take it. You feel me? Y'all give us that, we're going to take it. We're going to take it every single time. You ain't have to jump. Run him over there. Okay, now let's go to the audibles. Now you can audible over one time to the 01 trap. Now, 
They're going to start doing three down linemen, trying to play a lot of people back. And all you got to do is hit him with that 0-1 trap. Make sure that this guy on the end don't get free. So pick up your blocks. Boom. We're going to cut that to the outside. <laughs> We're going to cut that to the outside. Mix it in. Give him a different formation. Keep the tempo of the game in your control. So here we go. Oh, one trap. They kind of wide this time. So I ain't worried about idea. So let them go. Uh, give me that. Give me that. We got three to four yards. I take it every single time. Now you can mix in the inside zone. It's a lot of good things you can do. They spread out. Now you don't want to just spam neither one of these plays. Inside zone. I see green back there. So I want to be a little close to my blockers. Uh, cut back across the field. Uh, don't do him like that, fat. Fat, don't do it. Fat, don't do him. Don't do him like that on the tube, though. Don't do him like that on the tube, bro. Our cross. So we're going to come out. Remember, this is how we're going to set it up the first time. Put a drag. Uh, check. That's how the play looking. Now, this X, you can do anything. Put him in a quick out. That's going to be your man coverage. Put him down the field, the tight end. That's how it's looking. So, X, if it's man coverage, Y, you're going to get underneath. They're going to play hard flats. He wide open, though. We even could have threw it to the A. That's AJ. That's uh, that's AJ, though. Get big down there one time for the two, baby. Let's go. Now, like, we're going to go through every play. We're going to do the Z spot. We're going to motion him over. That same trips look. Uh, we're going to block the running back this time. We ain't going to let him go out the backfield. Now, this time, we're going to fade, wiggle, slant, boom. It's looking like that. You got so many different reads you can do. What is that waggle doing? Okay, I see X. Now throw it over the top of his head, up the field. Possession catch to the touchdown. Y'all done seen too much already. Y'all got me some likes on this video like y'all should. So be ready for the next scheme. If y'all want y'all own custom scheme, make sure you email me. Make sure you message me. All the love and support I respond to everybody. Y'all keep y'all notifications on. Let's go.